Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of why you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can can and a can can, a can can, a can can, and a wheel. Now we're off to. Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming to the channel. And as you can see, who we're going to be discussing tonight, um, Mr. Harry, mm -hmm, Prince Harry, um, and Princess. Uh, or Sussex, Duchess, Duchess of Sunset, Sussex, ugh, Sussex, Pr uh, the Prince and Princess of the Sussex, I think it's called, but Harry don't seem like he happy, he don't seem like he happy, y'all, because they just bought a home, just bought a beautiful home, but from what the rumor is saying, he don't like the atmosphere, he don't like the environment, and he damn sure don't like the house. Okay, so let's get into it. Let's get into it. Why don't we? Um, they're back at home in Los Angeles. And he don't want to stay in Los Angeles anymore. It's too crowded. It's too busy. He wants privacy. So it seems like uh, Megan is listening to him. And it is rumored that they are looking for another home. I'm like, good lord. And the only reason they're saying that they will want to move is because he don't want to live in Los Angeles as well as um, the house that he now lives in has went up expeditiously, okay? And they want to take the opportunity to look for something else, a little bit more on Harry's pace or how he feels, what he wants in his home, okay? But my thing is Harry needs to sit down somewhere. Maybe y'all need to rent something for a while to see if y'all gonna even make it, okay? Because it seems like every time Harry go home, he always come back with shit. Shit on his mind, shit on his plate, and shit about what he's doing these days. But let's get on into it. We have an article from Cosmopolitan, and I think her name is Mihara Bonner. She brought it out today for us, us nosy bodies. They want to keep up with everybody's life and live vicariously through them. It states, so the title is, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are rumored to be selling their Montecito home. The couple have their eyes on a fancy new neighborhood. <coughs> now, my thing is, Harry better sit down and look at all these dimensions of the home that Megan's going to try to take him to. And he needs to say what's on his mind. And not just be so, uh, what do you call it, generous with agreeing to everything Megan says. Okay, because it's looking like Megan say do it, Harry is jumping. So we need you to come back to be a man now, Harry. We need you to toe the line with your wife. If you ain't happy with something or you don't like something that she doing, say it. Don't let it all build up to one big you know, blow up, and then everything come out, all right, but anyway, going back to the article, it says, looks like Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are gearing up for another big move, Accor according to Santa Barbara's news press, via the Express, the Sussex are considering leaving their Montecito home and relocating to a fancy neighborhood that has a collection of multi-million dollar mansions, with miles of horse trails and a private beach. Meanwhile, the Sun reports that the potential move comes as Montecito is experiencing increased property crime. Okay, Harry and Meghan first moved to Montecito after a brief stint in Los Angeles, and the relocation was a long time coming for Meghan in particular. At the time, U.S. Weekly reported that Meghan visited Montecito uh, Montecito in her teens and fell in love with the <coughs> excuse me the picturesque scenery and studying architecture. 
architectural okay moving there was always an option but to begin with she and harry wanted to give los angeles a shot more than likely not in this article just my sidebar megan wanted to live in los angeles she wanted to be there with the who's who's the uh people that make it sh you know rain make it sunshine they could do what it do and she wanted to be in the midst of all of that but looking back at her at her marriage or whether she's going to take that in consideration or she's just going to still be out there trying to be a part of the hollywood scene okay okay moving there was always an option but to begin with she and harry wanted to give los angeles a shot unfortunately harry absolutely hated it the timing was so wrong amid the coronavirus pandemic and the lack of privacy this source also mused that an added bonus is that Montecito, uh, Montecito is only just an hour away from los angeles hours hour okay you want to take that drive hell like you're going out of town but anyway i hope the traffic ain't bad yeah you might have put on another hour two hours to get to and fro i don't think that's a good move but hey if it's giving harry the privacy he's getting away from the paparazzi all the fanfare then it might be worth it i, I don't know but anyway it says um it's over it's it's just over an hour's drive from la which is where a majority of their work is based yet far enough away to escape the crowd the paparazzi and the tourism in hollywood the couple has obviously kept their home life private but we did see a glimpse of megan's office in a video the duchess did with melissa McCart mccarthy okay megan and harry haven't commented on their potential move like why would they but their property value has gone way up according to the sun the sussex purchased their home for 14.6 million and it appreciated in value by an additional 12 million which equals out to 14.9 million making it worth almost 30 million as a luxury real estate agent put it to the outlet property prices have soared in the past 18 months and show no sign of stopping harry and megan only had to sit back and watch their home value skyrocket will she be happy is the question will he be happy is the next question with their new move or planned on move to another subdivision that's encapsulated with multi-million dollar people not just the homes but the people have to have that kind of money to be living there okay but will they be happy or is this just a front for something bigger to come i mean is he happy in his marriage is he happy that his family is divided from his family he made for himself and the biological family that's over there in england would it always become something of a dark cloud over their heads well we don't know but we will update you all as the information comes in we would do a follow-up story on here is megan trying to make that move to make her man happy and hopefully he won't leave her for some other little philly or he just wants privacy he wants peace of mind and he wants to be able to not be in uh photographed by a paparazzi trying to get a, a you know a picture here or there okay but that's all i got for this video guys y'all like it love it gotta have more y'all know where to come and don't forget to subscribe like and share my videos bye bye